chest pain cardiac tampon or you'd have pretty bad chest pain with the tension pneumothorax again you'd have chest pain but pulmonary embolism potentially that could be it is definitely acute mitral regurgitation I put my house on it yeah and everyone has gone with it these are the correct answer acute mitral regurgitation is a complication of a myocardial infarction usually secondary to a papillary muscle dysfunction which the papillary muscles if you imagine your heart like this you've got your four chambers your you have um, your aortic valve here on the left side and if you imagine you have your mitral valve from the left atrium to the left ventricle like this um, papillary muscles anchor well such not true the papillary muscles are like this and then you Cordi tendinii, these, these little papillary muscles are attached to cordi tendinii, which attach to each of the leaflets of the valve and keep them in place. Actually, there's only really one papillary muscle per, per leaflet, but we don't need to go into high detail on that. Um, and if one of those ruptures, if one of those papillary muscles is dysfunctional, Sicily begins and so we'll get a bit of prolapse and a regurgitation okay guys I actually think I'm gonna have to stop the video here we only got through three questions but let's say let's call this a taster video